Have you had trouble updating your Runcam 5's firmware? If so, stay tuned. I think I've got the answer for you. In today's video, we're going to talk about the Run Cam 5 and firmware updates. Uh, if you're having issues doing it with the SD card, I've got the answer for you on how to fix that. The Run Cam 5, and I, I guess you could call this a review if you'd like. Uh, it has a video resolutions of up to 4K, 30 frames per second, uh, 2.7K at 50 frames per second. Uh, 1440p at 60 frames per second, uh, 1080p at 120 frames per second, or 60 frames per second as well. Uh, the field of view is 145 degrees. Uh, it, it gives you a format of a dot .mov. Uh, it supports an SD card up to 128 gigabyte. It has a 950 milliamp battery. Uh, the dimensions are 38 by 38 by 36 and listen this thing will fit uh, a lot of your mounts that the Session 4 works with. Uh, as a matter of fact I have a Session 4 mount on my Elegant and this fits in there perfect. This thing weighs 55.5 grams so it is a lot. So let's uh... Alright so this is the way any normal person would update their firmware for the Runcam 5. Uh, you would just search on Runcam 5 firmware and uh, follow the links to uh, to go to the page to uh, to update the firmware, which is uh, coming up. Usually, probably going to be the first link there, and then you uh, go down and download this file right here. And uh, once you get this file uh, downloaded to your computer, what you're going to uh, what you're going to want to do at this point is to unzip the file. Once the file is unzipped, you're going to take the BRN file and put it on the root of your Runcam 5. Turn the Runcam off, and then power it back on, and it is supposed to update from that point. So this is the Runcam 5. Um, there is a spot here for the uh, SD card. You just slide this little door right here open. And uh, like I said, it supports up to 128 gigabyte SD card. Has one button on top. Uh, those buttons do various things from formatting the card to, to a lot of different stuff. Uh, you have a USB port here on this side. Um, the actual instructions to update the firmware on the Runcam 5 is that you go to the website, which I'll have in the video here uh, in a minute, and uh, you, you put a file on there, put it in the SD card, turn on the Runcam, and it will update. Well, I tried that over and over, uh, even tried uh, different uh, SD cards. Uh, to no avail, I could not get the firmware to update. And uh, after working with Runcam 5, uh, I hope to show you, if you're having this issue, a way that you can update your firmware. Thanks for stopping by. Okay, what you're seeing here is an email that I received from Runcam. Uh, it is going to tell you to download a driver, and you just follow these directions on the screen. Look at your device manager. Make sure that uh, your device is there. Then you're going to download uh, a run, another file I'll have in the description. All the download links will be there. Run it and make sure that you have set up program all, read verify, auto power off, SPI in flash type, and none for customize. And uh, it should update to the latest firmware. When I updated, it wasn't the actual latest firmware, but after I did this update, I was able to get the latest firmware 
uh, on a normal way with no problems. Uh, everything everything worked fine. I hope this helps you out if you're having problems updating your RunCam 5 firmware. Thank you. If you're not a subscriber, hit the link below. Thank you. Thank you so much. Now let's see some footage from yesterday with the RunCam 5. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you.